Um, we'll keep Gedark. Against a fellow warrior. What is LCS? Uh, League of Legends Championship Series. Hello there. They cannot stop my work. It is the opening day for... NALCS. Ooh, a whetstone hatchet. You're just attacking with it in turn one, though. <clears throat> uh, I'm just watching. I'm not doing anything in particular with them. Alright. Doing with your hatchet, bud. Oh, look, a bumper car. Cool. See, I, I see people putting a hatchet into these rush decks, and it just does not make sense to me. Sure. Like, is that really the best use of your coin? What are, you, what are you hatcheting up in your hand here? Okay. Mm-hmm. Sure. Good thing this guy has three attack. Alright, um, let's use our cutting class now. Nitro boost. I'm gonna Og Merchant this, I think. Obviously, I know my opponent has the um, the rider, but this means that they can't just, like, you know, they may have to take extra damage for it. I guess I do have the Razor Main Raider, so maybe I want... Eh. I don't have anything else to do here. Then I have Anchorman or Razor Main Raider next turn. Yeah, we're doing this. Look, they have a stage dive thing. And this, could, this can easily just represent, like, or damage, whatever. Okay. You've now gotten... Did two face damage. Did one to a frothing. Now what do you got? Ooh, uh, a very marginally buffed Sword Eater. Sick. Getcha. And now I have a Whetstone Hatchet that I can Nitro Boost Poison, which is much better than just swinging it around willy-nilly. You just played that first before playing your Dark Rider, because maybe get something that actually works there. <clears throat> um, you're dead, right? Yeah. Back to work. Boom. Anchor smash. But yeah, my opponent, I feel, demonstrated how not. To use whetstone hatchet while well, i demonstrated the correct way heck we're all getting all of this going first we need we need like especially ones you know we want a ganarg we want Ashid or war song it's not the one we want especially against demon hunter who can just punch it can we get a good one no we can we can get nothing we don't have a good one we don't have a good two well we'll get it into trash we have razor main raider with some enablers though And I like draw Oasis Thrasher? Man Crick. Okay. This hand is awful! Oh, I tried Evolve Shaman deck floating around. I've seen people play Evolve Shaman. This is just, yeah, we're dead. I mean, my draws are so, so bad, and this guy is incredibly hard for me to beat at this point. Oh, okay. Well, that's among ways to possibly recover. Hmm. I mean, this is still in play, though, and this is kind of a disaster. All right.
-hmm. like, we're, what we're mostly doing here is like preventing our opponent from just being able to kill this easily. Obviously, like, not great. Guess I'm just doing this. I can't really, like, fight for a board against these. They just put more things into play. Just have to kind of try and smork where we can and use this. That one's annoying. Yep. Yep. Yep, yep. yep. All really annoying. attempt to seven my opponent here with this. Go for the 50-50. Yeah. I guess I should have swung with this first. Try and get maybe eight. Get him! Nope. Okay, well, at least I didn't have anything. Now they're just gonna play Dark Speaker Blackthorn and I'm dead. Or Kurtris. I see. Do we have to punch it? Maybe kill that. Oh, you didn't kill that. Okay. Illidari inquisitoring me here, killing two of these. Oh, you're hitting that in the face. Okay, hitting me in the face. Sure. Well. Not exactly the best draw. Hmm. That could do something. I haven't drawn. Oh, I drew a razor main. Yeah, we're probably just gonna get into this off, though. I'm probably dead. I have to kill that or it kills me. Oh yeah, the Envoy could have killed it, and I could have, I could have done more damage there. Yeah, that was bad. I should have just used the Envoy there. My bad, my bad. That was slightly, slightly too low. I actually did the math on what it, what the Envoy would be, just by itself, and not what the Envoy would be with, uh, with the buff. Can I kill you? I have an Envoy and a Raider. I also have two Anchorman, though. Okay, take eight. Hmm? 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 Eh, there's the Nazoth. Yeah. So this flips up, we get this. I'm actually, like, awkwardly close to lethal. You didn't have one of these. Impossible. 
Considering how awful the open of that game was, I literally did not have a one drop, did not have a two drop. My opponent played like Ace Hunter Kareen or whatever to kill my to kill my three drop. That was close. I did screw up with the. Uh, I would have done like two more damage, three more damage, which wouldn't have been enough for lethal there, but it could have cost me doing the math wrong on the uh, on the Warsong Envoy. Because yeah, I, I I for the Warsong Envoy I counted its frenzy and then didn't count the Cruel Taskmaster, which is how I was like, oh, I want to use it on this instead of this. So. So I've actually seen people um, playing Zoo with the new uh, the new pay life instead of mana when you draw cards guy. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this. It's it's so good to find Nitro Boost poisons or mana arms if I find them. Eh, well, we, we we have a Ganark now. Hello there. Uh, I'm actually gonna play this here. I think. To, yeah, my opponent is Control. This is great with the Man at Arms. It gets it out of range of the three damage removal, which is really important. Because we have the Ganarg, we want to be using the charges rather than just holding it. Four, four, buddy. I actually specifically want to play this first, so I can't get his, uh, Hysteriaed. Corrupts this. I'm going to swing with this. And coin the Ganarg. Because we want to get that for the Nitro Boost Poison, potentially. So right now, because I have a 4-4 four, four, and a 3-4, they cannot clear me with Hysteria. Cascading. Okay. Well, we have Nitro Boost for the weapon that pops up and whatever survives. Even if they have Hysteria here, with Hysteria this guy, I have one guy who survives. School Spirits. Okay. Drain Salt. Okay. Jet 14. Nitro Boost this. I guess we Nitro Boost. That's just lethal. We have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, you're dead. Alright, yeah. Boom. Turn 5 lethal. Let's go! Eat it! Uh, uh, uh! Talk about a hatch job. That's what, like, this is kind of designed to do, right? Like, that's how this deck is, is, is constructed. Is trying to get, like, maximal pressure off of efficient early plays. And uh, extra damage in with the weapon attacks. Get him! Alright. Mulligan everything. We have a hatchet. And a Krastanoff. It's deck destruction in Prime Gaming. Hysteria being being nerfed to or I think, is uh is really rough for that that deck. Hmm. I do want to hit this. Boom. Two cost four four. The calm before the storm. Looking for a new weapon? Uh, I played a CR because the note taker didn't copy. Yeah, note taker has to survive in order for that to uh to do anything. Boy. We have the Crast enough, or an Anchorman. Whoa, Arcane Anomaly. Whoa, and you hit an Unbound? Yikes. All right.
It's bad if they landslide, but it gives me, you know. Okay. Well, can't landslide this turn at least off of that. Gulch is ours. Okay. Aunt. Hmm. We got an eight power Razor Man Raider. Let's go, buddy. Attacks here. No, our car attacks here. I nitro boost poison this. I attack here. This attacks here, triggers with Rokara, buffs, and then attacks you. Oh, the, the, the buff happened after. Well, it double buffs anyway. But gets you for the, the 10. And we get the hero power. Look at how big my Razor Man Raider is. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. It seems like it should, but this is after it attacks. But it like attacks and it then like, I guess it attacks during the attack or whatever. When the frenzy trigger happens. Either way, it still just hit them for a lot of damage. And that's what we're looking for.